One time I was trying to uh, buy a broken TI or a non-working TI-89 off eBay, but unfortunately the buyer and I did not come to an agreement. So yeah, had to uh, had to skip that one. Anyway, something that I found really funny is that uh, on the listing, uh, the cal it was the calculator and uh, it's a uh, cover, the sleeping cover. And the funny thing is that the buyer had on that cover uh, a bunch of identities probably uh, maybe about 40 or 50 identities written using a sharp object probably and it had uh, formulas trick functions what was really funny about it is that uh, the things he had on the cover you could easily do all those things within the calculator itself but you must not know it so some of the things were uh, like uh, uh, cosine of 45 degree or secant of x you know stuff like that and uh, to do that let's start with a uh, secant of x first so this calculator has all the trick functions some of them are not here on the key for obvious reasons you cannot have all all the functions uh within a, a, a written on the keys so you can either uh access you can either access secant of x by typing it or by going through the catalog so first method is going to be uh, holding the alpha key and start typing secant sec okay so th those three letters correspond to the secant function and uh, whatever you want to put in the parentheses, secant of x, t is just, uh, it does matter. Okay, press enter, and uh, it's going to return 1 over cosine of t, as you can see. And the second method is by going through the catalog. So once you are in catalog, the alpha key is going to be locked in by, uh, automatically. So all you got to do is just uh, uh, press uh, the corresponding uh, key. So for secant, I was already here earlier. So for secant, it's going to be 3. If uh, we were looking for a cotangent, let's see, uh, it's going to be a uh, c. So that's going to be uh, this uh, parenthesis here. And uh, you can just, uh, you know, manage, scroll down, uh, as you can see. Okay, tangent of uh, x. And uh, it's going to return 1 over tangent of x. And uh, another thing is going to be uh, uh, the uh, the angles. If you want to find the angle of, uh, or, or, or the value of, uh, let's say, uh, if you want to find the value of, uh, let's say, a cosine of a 45 degree, then uh, if you type... Uh, we already have a cosine key here, so it's gonna be a second and uh, cosine of uh, whatever, uh, cosine of 45 degree. Okay, press enter. And if you return the same thing, that means that you must be in radian mode, so you can just go to mod and change your angle to a uh, degree. Press okay, and now we are going to get square root 2 over 2, as you can see. Right now, you know.